Wondered if you'd show up, Shepard. Figured you'd be too busy recruiting goddamn armies for this war you're in charge of. I could always use more help. I'll bet. I've seen footage of what happened on Earth. Tell you what. I'll see if some old contacts of mine are still around. Can't promise you anything, but if enough of them are still breathing, I can lend a hand. Why go after Cerberus? Started with them trying to hire me back after we hit the Collectors. Cerberus paid me enough after the Omega-4 relay. Retired is what I should have done. But it's tough to settle down, knowing the Reapers are on their way. What did Cerberus want? They wanted anyone with experience leading a fight. Gave me a tour of one of their new cruisers. Nice setup. Top of the line ship, organized crew, damn impressive weapons. Thought I'd been shot at by every kind of gun, but didn't recognize half of what Cerberus was using. What scared you off? Another hunch. Cerberus wanted me to lead their new recruits, but I slipped off tour to talk to their soldiers. Found a restricted area, and caught an officer without a helmet. Wasn't supposed to have done that, apparently. You saw what the elusive man did to his people? It's downright sick. I asked the soldier what the hell had happened to his face. Pissed him off. <laughs> or maybe he didn't even understand the question. Things go downhill with Cerberus from there? They didn't want me leaving, I can tell you. Shot my way out with one of their fancy new rifles. You know, I thought I'd find myself a bolt hole. Sit this one out somewhere warm and quiet. But no one tries to trick me into becoming a goddamn husk. Been picking up jobs against Cerberus ever since. What else were you up to before the war? I had Vito to hunt down after he got away from us on Zoya. Cost me nearly everything I'd made to track him down. But I did it. Found him on a son's base inside a colony. Hired some men. Stormed the place. Blew up the shuttle port first this time. So, what happened to Vito? Vito was holed up in a tower with nowhere to go. I was close. We could hear Vito panicking, screaming orders. Then this shadow fell over everything. Damnedest thing, hearing a battlefield go quiet like that. Bet you can guess what happened. The Reapers. Yeah, completely tore up the base. Bunch of harvesters scooped up everyone in sight. Saw one grab Vito, can still hear the bastard scream. He tried shooting, but the gun fell out of his hand. Then he looked straight at me. Finally saw me. Begged me to shoot him. What did you do? I walked away. Dodged the rest of the fight. Only one who made it back to the shuttle. Still. Felt like I won that one. You seem pretty calm about the Reaper showing up. Just wish they'd waited until I was dead and buried before setting Earth on fire. At my age, you're supposed to take it easy. But that fleet you're putting together might make the Reapers think twice if you pull it off. If? Nothing personal. There's just a hell of a lot that could still go wrong. We're not gonna have much luck just sitting around. True, but you've picked a hell of a fight to get yourself into. Free space is shrinking every day, and everyone knows it. Should get your fleets moving, at least. I'll keep it in mind. Who were those people you were with? Bunch of mercs from Omega. Signed on with them when I heard they were making a hit on Cerberus. Should have studied the job longer. There's no way you could have known Korlak stopped working for Cerberus. That's no excuse. I kill Korlak and I'd have done right by Cerberus. No. The way I see it, those bastards owe me. Do you know the current leader of the Suns? Vosk? Don't remind me. Little scumbag shot his mouth off on a patrol mission once. Got half his squad killed. Real popular after that. We couldn't boot him from the Suns fast enough. Should have ended his tenure with a bullet. Then what's Vosk doing as Blue Suns leader? He's vicious, organized, and a suck-up. Vito must have welcomed him back once I was gone. Vosk thinks he's got a bargaining position with Arya. What a laugh. I'll give it a month before she knocks his teeth in. No designs on the Blue Suns yourself? 
I spent some of the best years of my life putting the sons together. Nowadays, they're just another gang posing as mercenaries. Breaks my goddamn heart to see what Vito turned them into. So you're not interested? Nah. I was done with them a long time ago. See you around, Zaid. All right, Chef. Putting aside centuries of hostility, the Geth and Quarians... Welcome to Batarian State Arms. With the Elcor homeworld taken by Reaper forces, refugees from Dakuna are fleeing to the Citadel. Gruesome Academy also fell to the Reapers when Elysium Come was attacked, on. but Alliance forces were able to evacuate all students. Come on! Are you kidding me? I found a Prothean Spear on Gehinnom. Contact the Alliance and tell them Commander Shepard asked them to pay you for it. Yes, thank you. I'll call them right now. Come on! Refugee camps in the Citadel are straining existing resources, and the Council reports that food shortages may happen in the near future. More trouble in the Perseus arm as Reaper forces now control the Hades Nexus.